Hey guys, what's good? How you doing? I hope you are doing well. Welcome to the channel. Welcome to Vinyl TV. If you are new to this channel and if you are, please consider subscribing. I will appreciate it. Thank you very much indeed for stopping by. Thank you very much indeed for clicking. I want to show you what we got here. We got this gear. This is HP Deskjet 4120. E. This printer is multifunctional printer. It's multi-tax, triple in one if you like. In the sense you can copy, scan, print, and fast from this gear. This printer is dual band. You can connect it via Wi-Fi network and USB cable connection. I'm going to give you an overview of this printer. Then we connect this printer to Wi-Fi network. But before we start, Going to turn this printer around. This printer is built with your space in mind. It doesn't take a lot of space for office work, for student work, for business work. This printer is using ink cartridges depending on country you reside. 305 ink is what is using here in UK. You can also use 305 extra. From the back here, the power cable, three pin power cable is included in the packaging. Is connected right now, 3 pin power cable, and this port is for USB spot cable. I'm afraid USB cable is not included in the packaging. We have this at Vinet Store, free delivery here in UK. And this is the serial number for this printer. In case if you want to call the HP, and at the back here we have the paper tray. This is real paper tray. You can load various sizes of paper, that five sheet of paper, A4. 5x7, 4x6, various size photo paper. You can load it and adjust with the holder. You can see a blue, a blue, a blue holder here. You can drop it, adjust it for the printer, recognize the particular paper you are using. And this is automatic document feeder on top here. Automatic document feeder right here. Going to turn this print around. Here is the scanner, flat bell scanner. Can stick the document you want, ID card, various sizes of document you, you want here, and select the function from the L, from the screen, and it will do the job. This printer is very beautiful, very economical and affordable. I'm going to bring the camera around to show you some of the features. So from the features right here, this is for you to turn this printer on and off button. This button here is for you to copy black. So you copy black with this button. This button here is for you to copy color. This is LCD screen. Inside this LCD screen, you see a two line for the ink gauge. This is to show you, you can see it's full right now. Check my video, you see how we loaded the ink. When the ink is not in, it will be empty. Right now, you can see the three lines is full on each gauge. This is zero. This zero is if you want to copy the document, you can press this copy function and it will change. It will change from zero to different number, how many number of copies you want to. This is the recession for the Wi Fi, and this is the Wi Fi button. You can see from the recession, it's going up and down, and also from here, you can see a blue light is flashing intermittently. When you connect this printer to Wi Fi network, it will be a steady blue light, which we are going to do. This button here is it will ask you to press this to identify your proximity information button. This button here is for you to resume, and this button here is for you to cancel. So, this is the overview from right here. I'm also going to show you, like I mentioned, this printer is using ink cartridges 305, is what it's using. And for you to so open it up right here. And ink cartridges holder will come right in the middle. It does this automatically. Here we go. So it's using 305. Check my video how we load the ink. Press it down, press it down, and you remove it. If you want to go in, just need to push it up as well. Make sure you hear clicks on and close. Okay. And once you close it, it will move away from the middle and goes to the side. So this is the overview for this printer. Okay. What we need to do is to show you step by step. How to connect this printer to Wi-Fi network and for us to do that I will need you to please get your mobile device 
and try to switch off your mobile data sometimes this is not compulsory but it sometimes it interferes with the connection so what i'm going to do right now first of all turn off my mobile data and make sure that my wi-fi is connected okay so what i'm trying to do now right now switch off the mobile data and use wi-fi completely so now this is my mobile phone what we need to do is you need to go to play play store okay once you're in play store then type hp smart app from the search button here it is then you need to download it on your mobile phone okay right now it's already downloaded on my phone so i'm going to click it open and once you click it open give it time for this to be ready okay you can see it's ready now what we need to do is um the next thing we need to do is basically you can see a bell okay and a plus sign right so we need to press click on the plus sign once you click on the plus sign it will start it will move away then go to this for us to choose the option we want so choose a type of printer to add to smart hp smart is the first so set up a new printer set up and connect to a new print hp printer and start printing which we are going to do so you choose this option but if it's already a printer that you connected before then you need to add a printer that is already set up so what we need to do right now this is a new printer so we need to click get started now once you click get started it will ask you question how do you want to connect this printer the first one is connect wi-fi connect the printer to wireless network for the most flexibility which i will encourage you which we're going to do you can also connect this printer like i mentioned a tank cable connect the printer to using network router using a tank cable so what we need to do right now is connect wireless click on wi-fi and once you select wi-fi click continue now it will ask you get printer ready to connection place the printer so this is you know make sure that you place the printer on the flat surface then plug it on and power on connect your mobile device to the wi-fi network then turn off nearby location on your on bluetooth or your mobile device allow this when prompted smart hp smart require this permission to find and set up your printer so next thing we need to do is click continue and here we go once you click continue it will find the printer that is available so right now you can see this jet 4100 series is here so what we need to do click on it now we need to connect this printer to wi-fi network i have the information here wi-fi information so which i'm going to do okay and follow the instruction and for us to connect it so i'm going to type the wi-fi password you can get this from the back of your router and make sure the information you are putting is accurate otherwise it will not connect And once if you're happy with the information you put click enter okay click continue now it will ask you bluetooth is required to set up the printer click continue now it will ask you us allow hp smart app to enable bluetooth click allow right now it's turning on the bluetooth on okay next thing is is finding the printer printer is found the next on the list is preparing the printer now it's asking us press the flashing information button remember i mentioned this earlier press the flashing information button for security we confine your proximity to the printer which we are going to do and if you look over here the, this information is flashing right now okay it's flashing so what we need to do is just press it once and go ahead just once you press it then it will move away and we recognize it here we go printer prepared the next on the list is obtaining an ip address 
so it's obtaining the network ip address is what it's doing once it's done that the next thing is this connection finish, finish connection it will go ahead and tell you that printer is connected so right now it's actually connected because the blue light here the wi-fi button that is flashing is no longer flashing here we go printer is connected to wi-fi network you can see printer connected to wi-fi network so this is how to connect this printer then you just need to follow the instruction okay like if you click continue it will ask you to connect it will connect to hp service from hp service then you need to create your account if you want to subscribe to hp instant inc then you do all, all that from the app but because this is tutorial I, I need to skip this but i encourage you to do it after six months then you decide you can cancel it it's not compulsory myself like i mentioned earlier i like to do this uh, pay as you go you know um this is the next process you know you're just checking the printer status from there but right now our job is actually done this printer is connected to wi-fi network the next thing is just for you to go ahead here you go connect connected printing service click continue now it will go ahead here we go introducing hp plus okay this is just tell you about hp information now the next thing activate hp plus for smart printing capability or capacity then if you want to activate this you click go ahead and, and continue but if you don't like myself i don't know i do not i don't want to activate it right now so i will click do not want to activate you know it will just say are you sure you know you want you're not happy to activate this yes decline the hp offer okay so right now the next thing is um click continue here we go it's just registering the printer right now every now and then it will remind you about about this but this is how to right now is registering this printer welcome to hp account and use your hp account to enroll instant ink after setup and finish setting up okay uh now it's asking us about hp instant ink but uh, um you just need to wait now it's reminding us about redeem two months for ink redeem two months of printing with hp instant ink because this is tutorial so i'm going to skip this benefit like i mentioned earlier okay asking us are you happy to skip yes skip the offer now asking about let, let, let information about how to load the paper which will uh, i'm also good so you just need to go ahead and click continue now it also asking us to re request about uh, automatic auto auto update recommendation click apply your printer will update automatically once it's switched on here we go setup complete so right now let's print if you want to print that document you just need to go ahead and print that document but i'm going to skip on it skip the page you can also share the link with others not right now here we go hp plus right now i can see so right now this printer is there the only thing is we need to load the paper thread and also complete the alignment thread, which i'm going to show you on my next video this is how to connect this printer to wi-fi network if you're happy with this tutorial please smash the like button i will appreciate it share and subscribe it helps the channel thank you